Click the link in the description to visit AR.com for all your Elden Ring needs. Check out their discounted Steam, Xbox, and PlayStation gift cards for key savings. Greetings, Elden Ring Guru here. And today I'm going to show you how to easily kill the rodent that his demi-human swordmaster owns. We're going to own owns, and we'll be stunlocking the little rat. So all you need is a fast attacking weapon. I'll be dual wielding the hook claws, as well as a decent amount of stamina to keep the stun lock going. All we want to do is bait the creature into his jumping teleport attack. And when you see him disappear, you can just hold forwards and sprint, which will make him miss you every time he reappears. If you're locked onto him, you will trap with him, so he'll be wide open to attack as soon as he lands. Unleash on him when he does, until your stamina is nearly depleted. Then sprint away to get out of the range of him, and let your stamina recover before repeating the process. You only have to bait him three or four times to get the job done, and the more points you have in dexterity and stamina, the quicker he'll meet his maker. You don't have to engage him for any of his other attacks, just keep some distance from him at all times until he jumps and teleports. And that's all it takes to kill one of the ugliest bosses in Elden Ring. Subscribe for all things Elden Ring Shadow of the Earth Tree. I'll be making lots of tip videos and boss guides, as well as a full playthrough with an idiot that rages. And it's not me, don't get us confused. If you see me die, it's Thrust If you see me guide, it's the Ghoul. Click that notification bell. You will love it. Theodorix is laughing here, his scaly back too strong for a sword. And when he falls over like that, Rykard's got nothing to do. He's got no answer for it. Just sitting there. He can't believe he was only here to fight a human player. What's all this about? 